What's up, planner people? All right, so I've got a lot of planners here that I want to talk about. I have a bit of a planner obsession. So I figured I would <laughs> document my 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 planner journey. <laughs> I'm going to just go over my planner lineup. I have quite a bit of them. Um, this is not going to be a flip through. This is just going to be me showing you what I'm going to be trying to use. All right, so let's get started. I'm going to start off, I believe, with the minis. With the minis. Okay. So this first one here is my on-the-go planner. Um, and this one is the peachy painted cover. Um, and I've got this glorious Nautique cover. Isn't it beautiful? I love Nautique. Um, so this is my on-the-go. But what I did though, because um, this is originally a vertical. Um, and I guess I will open it up a little bit. But I actually attached it to the Biz Babe, which is a line vertical. Um, so I wanted to see how that would work. Um, I do like the vertical layout, but I'm a lister. And I figured a vertical, a line vertical might be better for that. Um, so that's why I... I guess you could, they call it Frank and Planned. <laughs> Those two together. And that one's that. All right, so my next mini in another wonderful black croc, no tea cover. Woo! This is my business planner. Um, this is actually not a happy planner. Um, I do have the happy planner Disney disc, black metal disc. This wonderful, gorgeous cover is from Fancy Plans Co. Sorry for the glare from the ring light. Isn't it gorgeous? Um, and then this one is a quadrant layout um, from Cloth and Paper. I decided to try something different for my business planner. Um, I just love how sleek this looks. Goes wonderful with this Nautique cover. So this is what I wanted to use for my business planner. All right. Something new to the lineup. Since I decided I was going to do this YouTube journey, I figured I'd need a social media planner. Um, most of the, the planner gals like to use a dashboard layout. So, I got this, and actually, this is the actual cover, um, how it comes, comes like this. But I just really love the inside, so I wanted to use this. And then I added some stickers, um, to the top. Isn't that look cute? My little metal gold disc. Alright, so, since I'm starting this YouTube... I said, well, let me go ahead and use this dashboard. It's really, I love how um, neutral this is. So I love to decorate, but I like to decorate on a neutral um, canvas. So that is that. Now, this one, I'm kind of in a debate on which one I should use. Um, this one I want to use for my wellness. This is actually a color block layout. I got the idea from Chappie Plans. Love her channel. Um, but I didn't know whether or not I should use a mini or a classic. I really like them both, but I don't know um, if I need all the space in the classic. And I did start decorating it before I started using it. Um, I love how it looks. Isn't that cute? Um, for, 
for my wellness. Um, and what Chavi Plans does is she lists different things that she wants to track um, during the week. Um, I just love that idea. So I decided I was going to get the color block layout and try it. However, I was like, I don't know. Do I need all that space? So then I said, let me try the mini. So uh, and these are made these little stickers. <laughs> um, but I don't know. I, I'm 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 gonna see. I might try both for the month of August and see which one benefit me benefited me. Um the most whether the bigger layout or the small layout um and since that was my last mini you already know what i'm gonna do with this classic this one was from walmart actually both of these were from walmart um which i just love this leopard <laughs> I, and crazy thing is i was not always an animal print girl but for some reason my happy planet obsession has <laughs> made me turn over a new leaf okay so the next one, speaking of animal prints, this right here is Colorful Leopard. It's a classic. Um, and this one I'm going to use as my finance planner. Um, line vertical I'm going to use to track my spending. Um, up here I'm going to put like what bills are due on this day. Of course the monthly I'm going to have the bills on here as well. But I really like this line vertical um, to track my spending. Um, and of course love the leopard. Alright. So and this one Here's another toss up, okay? Like I said, I have a little obsession. <laughs> I started off doing my journaling in here. This is a vertical, right? Got the idea from planning with Bumble. Oh my gosh, she's another um, planner, um, planner babe, I guess they like to call them. I love her channel channel oh my gosh it's wonderful so i like the idea but even though it looks gorgeous the 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 vertical like writing um this way i feel like my mind is more of a horizontal writer if that makes sense so that's why i recently got this one and i was trying this out and like it I kind of like this even though aesthetically I love I love how this vertical looks and this is a gorgeous planner I mean come on look how pretty it is I love how this looks but I feel like my mind works better going horizontally <laughs> when I journal so right now I've switched to this um for my journaling. And then here we go for my catch all. Now, I was up for a debate on whether or not I was going to keep a mini for my catch all or if I was going to go to a classic. Um, there's just something about a classic. I really love the space. Um, this is gorgeous, of course. Added rose gold disc to it. Um, but I, I feel like I'm, uh, vertical. Well, no, that's not, I can't say that. Because I love, I kind of like all the spreads. So, <laughs> it's whatever move fits me. But right now, I'm really loving the vertical classic for my catch-all. And just staying with the... Um, staying with the mini for my on-the-go planner, um, and then I have a couple of more. A couple more. They're not really planners per se. I mean, they are planners, but I'm not using them um, necessarily as a planner. So let me get those. All right. So I have my skinny classics, <laughs> and yes, I have multiple. 
<laughs> I'm telling you it's a problem. <laughs> okay, so this one is the grace for the day. I got this from Hobby Lobby. This one I'm going to use for my faith planner um, as far as just writing down um, verses of the day and being able to study those. Um, I really like this planner to get my verse and what I can focus on for that day. I'm going to do a flip through of these, of most of these planners. Some of them, um, maybe not, but definitely the skinny classics. So I'll do a flip through of these. All right. And the next one I have is this indigo tie dye. Blue is my favorite color. <laughs> Does have a lot of blue, but I love it. All right, so this one I'm gonna use as my quotes. Um, inspirational quotes, positive things that I can focus on. Um, just so I can focus on being positive. And I mean, I'm a positive person, but I like to reinforce that by looking into quotes um, and different positive affirmations, which brings me to my other skinny classic, which is Sophisticated Pools. And this is the one that I'm gonna be writing in my affirmations, my daily affirmations. Um, and did I, need a, did I need a separate planner for each one? Probably not, but do I love to do it? Yes, I do. <laughs> um, so this is gonna be my affirmations. All right, and so last, and I can't even say last because I actually am looking at a notebook over here <laughs> that I'm gonna do an honorable mention for because they're not planners, but I do use them. Um, but this one's gonna be my word of the day. Learning a new word every day. I find it very interesting. And then I've, I've documented um, in this planner. This is another colorful leopard. Gotta love the leopard. Oh, these beautiful. I don't remember which planner I got these off of, but I wish I had gotten more. I just love this color. Isn't that pretty? But all right. Okay, my honorable mentions. Beauty and florals. I said I was going to learn languages. I actually took French in high school. Of course, I don't really remember anything. <laughs> I mean, I remember a little bit, but I said I wanted to learn that again. So, um, French is one, and then Spanish. I would also like to learn Spanish. So, I've been using Duolingo to, um, you know, document um, the different things that I'm learning um, so I can learn another language. Let me see. But yeah, so this is what I'm using for that. This is a notebook. These, I love metal discs. They're pretty. Okay. All right, now the honorable mention. Just write notes. If I think of things that I want to write down, I'll just jot it down in here. I love this. I got this from Hobby Lobby. I just love this color palette. It, it's just really just gorgeous. But yeah, so that was my huge line of planners that I am obsessed with, but I'm going to use them. I mean, because who would put that much money into these and not use them? I mean, you just, I mean, you have to <laughs> at this point, <laughs> you can't let it go to waste. But yeah, so this is my my lineup. And so I will see you in the next one. Bye.